everyone, and here's our devotional for Friday, February 23rd, 2018. Enter his gates with thanksgiving and his courts with praise. Give thanks to him and praise his name. Psalms 100, verse 4. When I enter his gates and his courts, I want to come bringing nothing but praise and thanksgiving. When I see all the wonderful things he has done, I want only to be thankful to him and bless his name. I wish I had my focus on me right now, because if I did, I would read the devotion that I just read this morning, on the day that I'm recording this, um, from the Come Away My Beloved book that I've been reading. And it was exa- about that very thing, about how, you know, when you come into his his courts, enter into, into his courts, so to speak, as the word says, um, you know, you, you don't come with... A heart that's full of all kinds of other junky stuff that doesn't belong there. I mean, yes, we need to take our our worries, our fears, our problems, our complaints, our our whatever to the Lord for him to help us. But I think, you know, what it was talking about was not coming in with a heart of just all that grouching like I do. Like, you know, and I don't like what's going on and whatever. But he, you know... To come with that stuff and say, Lord, yeah, this this has me up. This has me discouraged, but I want to trust you. I want I want to trust you and not worry about it. Now, in my own humanness, I'm like, I trust you, but but please just help. Please fix this, you know. And I don't know how you're going to fix this, but um, but that's not he want, what he wants us to do. He wants us to say, I trust you, Jesus. So, hey, everybody, say that with me right now. I trust you, Jesus. No matter what's going on in my life, I. Trust Trust you, Jesus. <laughs> and um, back when I was reading the Jesus Calling devotional, and I know Aunt Bo, I know you read that one too, so you probably know what I'm talking about. But um, and maybe others of you have. And actually, I am actually able to start reading that one too, so I'll have to remember to do that. Um, but there's a, a time when it kept. Every day, you know, repeating, say, I trust you, Jesus. And the one said, you know, if you're having a hard time, say, I trust you, Jesus. And he was like, the more that you say it, the easier you'll, it'll be for you to get into the habit. So because I read that, um, God gave me this song. And yeah, it's kind of repetitive, um, but I hope it'll be a blessing to you. And I know some of you have heard it before, but it's called, I Trust You, Jesus. I just want to sing the chorus for us. I trust you, Jesus. I trust you, Jesus. When I don't understand, into your hands, I know you, I will leave it. When things aren't going quite like I think they should I know you are working it all out for my good So up to your face I will look And say I trust you Jesus Yep, that's our lesson for today. Lord, help us to be able to say with ease more and more often, I trust you, Jesus, and to not worry about things, but to put them in your hands and leave them there. So may the Lord bless you all and be with you till tomorrow.